to my friend Sue. We are at ABL. So this is our last week of the four-week progressive of our American Guineas Wild Bronze level. Congratulations, everyone. You passed. At the end of this, what we did is we, we talked about some silver patterns that have been changed to bronze patterns, but then I showed you bronze and silver patterns, and I showed some points that Cliff really wanted to see. <laughs> All right, Cliff. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate that for you. So the first thing we talked about was what we call the flip-flop. So the flip-flop has been adapted from the silver syllabus to more of a bronze, where we're actually taking the lean and we're passing it back and forth. Okay? What we want to think of is not rising so much. Um, so we have, we're going to go into a twinkle, and we're going to do it in more of an open fashion where we're not going to close our feet. So we have one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two. Then we have it where the, the leader passes pat the, the follower and then the follower passes. So we have like a flip floppy, a real flip floppy, mm -hmm. instead of a lady being tossed, right? So we have one, two, three. So what I'm gonna do is take my center across the path of my follower. One, two, three, and then the same, she does the same. Then I go, then she goes. What we want to think about doing is making sure that whoever's in the center of the, of the whoever's passing forward it goes big, the person in the center goes small. So as I'm passing Sue, she's moving, but she's actually letting me go past her. I also put her more in the back seat position. While it's the other one, I kept her more forward by not allowing her to come behind me. Now I actually want to have her go behind me so that it will give me enough time to get past. So when I do my twinkle, I put Sue more in a backward position as I come across, and then allow her to go, and then I go. And that gives us our flip-flops. Okay. Then we had, finally, which was the uh, points. <laughs> so we do is we're doing a reverse turn, and then we're going to point. Okay. So this is a nice little step that I have. One, two, three. Point, point, and then one, two, three, cross. Let's do that again. No fear, part two. 